Hey everyone, it's Mindy Hahn, the Midwest Premier Sports Handicapper, coming to you from TonySpicks.com and the half of the morning show duo, The Morning Steam with Ramon Scott. Uh, but hope you enjoy this free pick video from our show. Uh, be sure to click in the link in the description for our best bets. Now here is the pick. The Hawks and the Wizards going to start us off with our card today, Mindy. And this one, the Hawks on the road against the Hawks. I don't want to know. I want to say they're the most overrated because their spread record is not horrible. But uh, here they are favored on the road against a hard trying Washington team that seems to find a way sometimes to get these numbers. And the total is 236 and a half. Yeah, all I can re remember is, uh, you know, when I watch Hawks and Heat, the uh, uh, you know, the Hawks look tired out there. They just look tired. Oh. I don't know what the deal was with them. But anyway, I'm going to go ahead and uh, uh, hope that they are showing up refreshed today. I'm going to go ahead and take the over in this one. Uh, both teams one and two over the last three Hawks scoring. 122 a game. The Wizards putting up well over 115. The over is four and one Hawks last five on a day's rest. Now that they're all rested up from that game. Uh, over four and won the Wizards last five as well. Going over. Over, over. <laughs> Give me the over with Mindy for sure, I would think. And this one, uh, how did we get stuck down here in the uh, mid-220s? Uh, is this not the NBA? <laughs> is right. this a Tarpy uh, situation, you guys? Because uh, – to me, it feels like they just kind of took a lower uh, number. It's obviously, you know, I mean, most people are going to have it uh, rated the same way here to uh, 36 and a half. So uh, I think over, Mindy. Uh, you know, I, I wanted it to come maybe in the mid to a little bit lower, but uh, I'm willing to go on this one with you. It feels to me uh, closer to two, I would say 240-ish. Uh, you know, I don't think it's smashed this total like it is, but uh, I'm willing to do it with you just considering what these teams can do uh, to the uh, number. So I think I said 220, but I mean, at uh, the uh, beginning of the segment, that was just a slip up though, but yeah. you know what I meant. Uh, I thought this would be the 239-ish uh, type of thing that always bothers me, but uh, <laughs> Atlanta 21 and 13 to the over on the road and 23 and 12 to the over as a favorite. I think we can get over this number. Not much. Uh, oh, here's Ron. He wants the, he does want, with the, no, 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 no. Ron Hawks are favored. Yeah, he so, says two more down. Oh, oh, thank you. Okay. Money line. Neil says that is a big number. Yeah, I agree. I agree. I've only I've got a few points over than this, so I'm going to roll with Mindy here. I mean, I am, after all, following a, a pretty <laughs> pretty hot capper. So, Hawks money line. I see. Okay, thank you. Okay, Rod. Yeah, I I got it. Yeah, I'll be with Rodney probably in this one. But let's go over Mindy. Get our show started. There, I, I imagine we'll have a we'll have a bit of a sweat, but I'd I'd much rather have the over than the under. Doesn't necessarily want to mean I want to sit it out because hey, we got to pick one or the other here. <laughs> right. Washington won that one, one nineteen, one sixteen. They were a seven and a half point underdog in that one at Atlanta, so that was just two thirty five ish. <laughs> Here's a uh, uh, C spill with Atlanta. And Rodney's saying Atlanta road bad, but Atlanta for the season has been good on the road. But Mindy, you, you mentioned it. I mean, if you, you know, know, right? tired, if you think they look tired, me and Bo are hanging out with the Wizards. But they just covered in that crazy last shot, right? Versus uh, the Heat there, right? On the road. Yeah, you're talking about, uh, at, uh, you're talking about uh, Atlanta? Yeah, I so said. Yeah, Hawks yeah. failed to cover yeah. each other. Right. I thought, I mean, watching the end game, the way it was unfolding, you're like, well, I guess they can't get it now because, <laughs> uh, you know, I think the line was two and a half and they were down three, five, whatever. What, but yeah, 130 to 128 was the final there. Brent's on the Wizards. So 
And uh, maybe I need a logo like Bo. Are you like have my? Yeah, like uh, someone has to. We're getting our own our own thumbnails. By the way, maybe we have all these cool thumbnails on right. the uh, on the site that uh, the but uh, we're getting our own cool uh, thumbnail. So soon, like it sounds like the next couple of days. So you don't just see our faces popping up oh, anymore. Man, I'm excited. Hey, uh, Mindy, I just want to let you know right now, you guys, I, while we're, before we leave this game, um, you know, if you're following on screen, whatever, uh, I think we're going to see uh, the Wizards look to be on the move, actually. I think they're starting to take that. It's not as heavy as I thought, but the uh, steam, yeah, so, oh, well, uh, let's take the over, Mindy. I think people can uh, determine what they want to be on, but. Uh, it looks like they're, the chat's pretty mixed on this game. So everyone to each their own on the side, I guess. Thomas says he doesn't even mind the Washington money line here. Brent says uh, Wizards not healthy. But uh, Kuzma's back, so Monty Morris questionable. We know that. Hey, there's some steam coming in right now in college basketball, everyone. Want to just talk about it real quick? Uh, St. Bonaventure, they're taking steam right now uh, in their game against Davidson. I mentioned it because it's just two hours away. And uh, Bonaventure taking steam right now at plus four against Davidson. All right, let's continue on in the NBA right now. And uh, let's see here. Well, I thought we had one more. Uh, so I wanted to say hello to Wapik. Wapik. Welcome to Wapik. I think Wapik stopped by before and said hi. That I seem to remember that name. Um, if not, though, hello and welcome. And sounds like a pretty good name for someone in a gambling chat. See, sounds like <laughs> Wapik is someone who knows what they're doing, uh, if I were to speculate. All right. So thanks for watching and make sure you get over to the toniespicks.com website right now and check out our all cappers tab where you can purchase some of our own personal picks and be sure to go ahead and use the promo code TONYT at checkout to save 20%. Okay, have fun. Watch another video. Take care, everyone. Bye-bye.